that she had coming in. So she, I'm talking to her, and, 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 okay, here's my thing. I tell this motherfucker, I say, look, don't ask me a question first when you ultimately want something from me. Don't walk in the room and say, what you doing later? Then that makes me want to lie. That makes me go, oh, shit. I don't know what's going on. Uh, I'm going to the moon. <laughs> right? Then she goes, oh, because I was going to suck your balls later. What the fuck? Ah, I'm not going to the moon. <laughs> fuck, but now you can't say I'm not going to the moon because you, she goes, you were lying. You understand what I'm saying? Right. When you want something, you come in and go, listen, I was thinking about sucking your balls. Are you going to be busy later? You tell me what the <laughs> fuck you want first, bitch. Now, I'm sitting there for an hour and ten minutes trying to Figure logic out. my way yeah. to her, trying to let her know why that puts me in a bad fucking spot to have to... It puts it on me. But wait. What? How about just not fucking lying when she asks you what you're doing later? Do you understand? Do you see? That's logical. Do you do just you, answered your own. Do you see why? It's like even the the smart ones don't fucking get it. No, because why would like I? No, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Why the fuck? Right. Let me tell you what it is. You don't like sweet talk. It's passive aggressive. It's passive aggressive, and you know what else it is? It's it's because you're. But if you already wait know. a minute, you're not tuned in to rejection. I'm gonna explain to you again, and then I'm let you talk. You're not tuned into rejection from a man on a daily basis, meaning this. If you go, can I, d I want this, right? Mm -hmm. What's wrong with coming to me saying, I would like you to do this for me? And you know why you don't do that? It leaves too much open for me to go no and for you to be rejected. But if you ask, if you put it on me, what are you doing later? Nothing. Okay, if you're not doing nothing, you think we can go to the movies? Now... I might want to do nothing and not go to the motherfucking movie. So just say, I, honey, I don't want to go. Do you think it's that simple? Are you out your mind? Hey, sweetheart, it's that simple for me. Offer another suggestion. Well, okay, first of all, wait a second. I am all about open communication, okay? okay. Do not get me wrong. Go I ahead. understand what you're saying, and I totally appreciate it. As a girl, Will as a Will you woman, fucking just get it out? I'm right. No, my fucking point is this, Patrice. See, you're making Paris. me curse. There you and go. I don't like We're bringing out what you exactly. really are. Okay. First of all, wait a minute. Keep that thought, and this is perfect. This is, listen, ladies and gentlemen, this is why we need a woman on the show to let you know that this is, even though you're super smart, this is the shit you do. You gotta but, preface it with something that we don't want to hear first. You know what's, what's funny but is when you, you, when you said that, like that, when you said that, it clicked in her head and then she went to level two, how can I combat what you said exactly. in the first place? No, it's place. not about combating. I am agreeing with him. I agree. We should be communicating better. But however, if you already know that your woman is going to do that, then like, you, you're you already one step ahead. You're saying you know she does this all the time. If it's a tactic. Why the fuck am I supposed to put you're accommod on that accommodate. shit? You're an equal part of the relationship, are you not? Fucks no. I lead the relationship. Oh, my you, God. How the fuck can you have a 50-50 relationship? Oh, my God. Okay, well, you know what? You can take Who's, turns. Wait, no, no. You can no, take you turns. Can't. Why you want your fucking no, you Why can't you? No, you, you? can't. Because you don't have the ability to lead. As, me? I don't have the ability to lead. As a woman, to you don't have the ability Are to lead. Are you shitting me? No, no, no you don't absolutely lead. not. Where are you going to lead me to? <laughs> Wherever I want you to go. Exactly. What suggestion do you have? For what? For going anywhere? For no. anything. Do you think... Ready? Ready? Hold on, wait, hold on, wait. Ready? Do you think, do you think men should call women bitches? It depends on the situation. Do you think women should call women, men should call women bitches? It depends on the situation. Frivolously. Should no. I just say, hey, bitch? Not if you don't know somebody. Why not? Because you don't know them. You don't know if they're a bitch or not. Hmm. Really? That's a good enough answer for you? Yeah, it is. It's not. You know why? You gave me no reason. You just said... Di because it's because wrong and disrespectful. <clears throat> no, it's And not. you don't even know That's just person. how you feel. That's like, should I go up and say, hey, Wait asshole? Wait a minute. I told you... Hey, asshole. I told you why... Hey, asshole. I say bitch. You're not yeah, giving me a reason saying, why I shouldn't. Because you don't know I'm if they don't you, deserve your respect. You're going in there assuming. Mm -hmm. You're going in there assuming that they don't deserve your respect. Why is bitch a disrespectful term? Because of how it's used. Why? That don't, makes it disrespectful. Don't why? women don't women automatically <laughs> expect men to to respect them? No, automatically. Because if they did, no, if they, they, did, no, if they did automatically, women would treat themselves better. Than they do, and they would they would act more accordingly. What are you? I don't understand about? what that. I don't. I don't know. Cat, what I, I, don't know what I think there are a lot of women who there are a lot of women who have self esteem issues. Do you hear that? Hey, all of you no, have self esteem not all issues. Of us do. That's why you're not good at the leading thing. You're not. You're good soldiers. You're not good generals. You don't want a good. You don't want to be in charge. 
Here's what you want to be. You want to constantly test to see if this person. You ever see that movie, um, Master and Commander? The, uh, yes. the, the, yes. the shit with yes. Russell Crowe? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, yeah, yeah, and yeah. The, Paul, Paul Bettany. Yes. And the guy goes, the guy is walking around, uh, Russell Crowe's second in command is walking around the ship, right? And he's trying to be friendly with the motherfucking, um, with the, with the mates. With the crew. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and they're looking at him like, yeah. this pussy ass yeah. nigga. Okay. Now, Russell Crowe snatches this guy. First of all, Russell Crowe said, he saw the two, the two guys looking at him funny. Uh, he goes, get to the, put them up against the, the, the mask and give them that cat and nine tail. Right. Fuck him up. Right. And he had to go and call this guy and go, look, let me tell you something, man. They're not These your friends. dudes are not your friends. They are looking for someone to lead them, but they want to be led by somebody that they believe in. Mm. That's a woman. Women want to look at a guy and believe that he will lead them where they need to go. But they're going to test him like he's a weak-ass second mate. And if this motherfucker goes, well, I'm going to just buckled. be your friend, yeah. I'm gonna, you're going to disrespect him. That's the nature of the game. In every single <laughs> part of the world, on every single level, the bitch version of an animal is weaker than a fucking man version. Except for praying mantises and men. And black widows. Yeah, go down the spiders that I can smash with my feet anyway. <laughs> I'll step on either one of them motherfuckers. How about that? So other than a couple of insects. So what about seahorses when the guys get pregnant? Exactly. That's what they have to do. You this gotta, is where a smart but bitch but comes in because she knows what I'm fucking. What about <laughs> dung beetles? The women, the women dung beetles don't push shit around. <laughs> Goofy ho. But that's what they do. This is what I'm saying, fellas. You got? Do you see what Kaz is doing? This is what your girlfriend does, and you have to never. Let me tell you something about Let that. Deflect. Don't lose the war. Hey, exactly. I can lose a battle, but win the war. No, don't yeah. even don't. fucking concede a battle. Women do like you women. fucking win battles every single, no matter how little it is, no matter how insignificant you think it is. You fight and so that the bitch any. adds an option to her life. Okay, and give you another thing. Any. Give you another a story about my girl found an option. And this is how your girl will find an option. When she starts opening her fucking mouth. Yesterday, <laughs> oh, <laughs> my girl God. don't open her fucking mouth anymore. When she can't, that old saying, don't let your mouth write a check, your the ass, ass can't cash. cash. You understand? So this big black bitch at, uh, <clears throat> at GameStop. <laughs> I'm sitting there talking to them. You know, if at GameStop, there's only one goofy ass motherfucker who's taking care of a whole store full of geeks, and he is slow and he's an asshole. And when you get to him, you wanna you wanna develop a relationship with this nigga. So I'm talking to him, and this motherfucker's like, "Oh yeah, I'm gonna go. What about uh, Gears of War? What about this? What about that? What you think it is? What's new? How, what have you heard about this? I bought some new shit, um, World War II battle thing with planes and boats and shit. So he's like, "Oh, and this big black." Uh, Oh, all this chit chat. All this. <laughs> What's all this? With, with, with nobody there to stop me from punching her in her fucking mouth, <gasps> except for social contract. The fact is that she believes that socially she I can't can knock her in her fucking mouth. But if I was that a screw loose, I could turn around and wring this bitch's neck just for that. Now my girl did that shit talking to some motherfucker and I and she's in his face like, let me tell you something. I walked away. She goes, Whoa. She runs up to me, right? And goes, Why would you do that? Well, why would you run? You know, he could have uh, 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 he could have what? They could have what? Why do it? Why do now it? Now she has an option. That dude could have punched you in your fucking face. And you couldn't do shit about it except for look at me. So you're going to have to learn respect. It trickles down from me. Anger. You, you Anger. got.